cool. to yeah. uh, our lunch and learn, going green, um, one change at a time. Uh, my name is Angel Martinez, and I'm with Camera Supply. And I uh, just want to introduce you to the rest of our staff here. Uh, my partner, Jim Young. No, uh, that's his dad over there, Bill Young. And my wife, uh, Nancy Martinez. serviced uh, many different types of companies over the years, uh, municipalities, some of the, the larger companies such as ExxonMobil, BP Overseas, and also uh, uh, Pepsi-Cola, Coca-Cola as an outsource for purchasing. Uh, to us, purchasing is a process. It's not about the item. It's more of uh, the services that we provide. Uh, a typical order for Amro Supply is 50 line items from 30 different manufacturers. So we coordinate and do all the logistics for that. In our uh, ventures into different arenas, we ran into uh, Green Stuff uh, back in the early 90s when it was actually owned by the Berryman Company. And one of the things that we learned uh, very early in our, uh, in our careers was that uh, on the international market, uh, when people find a product that they like, they seem to stick with it because in some of the rural areas that they live in, it's very difficult to get certain products. And Green Stuff is one of the products that once uh, some of the clients uh, grabbed a hold of, they stayed there. So we followed the product until now to the point where we have uh, the very many company uh, sold the product to a company called D2L, and that's the relationship that we're seeing here today between Amherst Supply and D2L. So with that, I'm going to turn this over to Eric Fortmeyer from D2L Products, and uh, help me to give him a warm welcome. Thank you very much. Well, thanks, uh, y'all. I'll let you uh, finish uh, eating for the time being, and I'll just tell you a little background stuff, and then we'll get to uh, doing some demonstrations. But um, don't forget, there is some cake back in the corner there, too, so please eat it or else I'll be eating it. So I'll like that. Um, but we are um, classic small business. Uh, we took over for, uh, for the Berryman Company, which is a company out down in Texas, down in uh, Fort Worth, Texas. They had developed this product called Green Stuff back in the mid 90s. Um, and the idea was they kind of discovered it by mistake, to be honest with you. Uh, the guy who invented it was an Irishman, so they colored it green, and that's why it's Green Stuff uh, at this day. But um, they basically invented it for the purposes of a lot of industries were finding it's very hard to use speedy dry uh, when you're cleaning up stuff. There are certain situations where you're in a plant situation, you don't want to be throwing rocks down on the floor where there's some pretty high-tech machinery around there. So they wanted a product that could basically do absorbing of uh, basic liquid, basic hydrocarbons, and a couple exotic uh, chemicals as well. And uh, Berryman Company developed green stuff uh, for that purposes. They noticed along the way that it's incredibly efficient, doesn't take up much space at all, absorbs an awful lot, and it's extremely versatile. And they started promoting it as an environmentally friendly product in Texas in the 1990s. And as you might imagine, Nobody cared. Uh, it just was not an issue uh, to the Texans down there. They got lots of land uh, down there, infinite amounts of landfill. You could dump a pile of toxic waste from the Texas wastelands out there. No one would notice for 40 years out there. So no one cared for the most part. Uh, but the people who did care were mostly in the refinery business down on the Texas uh, Gulf Coast, uh, up in Louisiana. Uh, they really liked it a lot. Uh, for a while, and that's where most of the business stayed with Berryman for them uh, down in Texas and Louisiana for a while. And then eventually what happened was Berryman went through some problems, they reorganized, and they were basically going to start getting back to their core products, and they were ditching a few products, and they decided to let green stuff go. And my business partner and I um, picked up on it right away, because we had, had some pretty good experiences with it, to say the least, and uh, we now completely control uh, the product. We've tweaked it a little bit, made it a little bit better, so if anybody has ever used green stuff before, it's a little bit better uh, than it was back then. And um, it's still a pretty remarkable product. And as it turns out, right as we were picking the product up, this this green thing, everything now has to be environmentally friendly out there. And now we have to do more with less and uh, you know save the planet and all that kind of stuff, which is great. It's phenomenal. Um, but it's challenging to do.